Hello, so this is one number four. These are the bands. And for this one, I'm bringing um, Void, Kate Bishop, and America Chavez. Kate brings an interesting synergy for Chavez because it decreases the duration of regen and indestructible, which is nice when fighting things like uh, Hawkling and Gorn. And so I had the illusion that uh, this synergy would be enough to fight a core later on on the one open node with Chavez, and you will see that will be the first death of uh, this season for me. First fight is an apocalypse. I'm thinking it with America Chavez. And the plan here is not complicated. Build my charges. Bait SP1. There we the second line chain. dimension was slowly preparing for a special two. There I uh, didn't manage the decks. It's almost down. Next fight is a Sasquatch. I'm taking it with Void. Void is actually pretty good uh, this season because um, thanks to the tactic, he benefits from two extra debuffs, Wither and Slow, which uh, increases his damage by quite a bit. I'm trying to go around and stop the ball. See how many rebirths uh, he has already, that's pretty nice. Can add one with the, the relic. And so that's it. Then next section we have a weekend that we'll take with Void again. <clears throat> Void is good because he's incinerate immune, so basically you don't have to worry about uh, the neutralize somehow. So I can parry my Objective now is to bait special one, so I go at the end of the screen, immediately dash in. Just place the slow. Next fight is a Hawkling. So I like Chavez because um, with her negative zone she can decrease the power gain from the Witch Catch Reacher's node. So we start with two heavy attacks. And as I mentioned earlier, the Kate synergy allows to decrease the duration of his regen indestructible boosts. Buffs, I mean. Open 
hitting the third dimension now. I might refresh the negative zone because which get restrained can be dangerous. Principle is not good for this matchup because with one eye open she cannot spam uh, heavy attacks. You know, because when she throws heavy, she stuns the opponent. So when the protection is on, as it is the case now, it's not a big deal. But when the protection is off, you cannot really use your, your heavy attack. But with the Kate Synergy, I had the illusion that uh, in the end the uh, regen buffs wouldn't do much. So I thought, you know what, they can simply uh, do normal combos and he will go down. Um, unfortunately, um, she kind of needs her cycle. So basically I will do that until a minute or something. And at some point uh, I will get clipped and uh, die to the boss. Before that, I will make a mistake. I will throw a heavy attack with the protection off. Um, and, well, exactly. So apparently at my age, I cannot pay attention uh, more than a minute. So it's true that his health is already low. But um, yeah. You know, with the power efficiency, you have to spam many special ones. In the meantime, you have the regen that goes on. The mistake though, is I could have used a special two. I don't know why I didn't do it. So you see, he was at the third, now he's half health. There I made a mistake and I would finally get clipped. And with all these debuffs, there is no way that uh, she can survive it. So then I come back to finish him. Um, so I don't think I will bring her again uh, for this node. Maybe I could have brought a uh, long shot, um, who is very effective against score. Um, maybe make room for Tyra. I don't know. Anyway, so that's it for this war. See you around.